date off the top. This is trivia. Please indulge me. They tried to cover it up. You'll probably see it at home, but I, I had the, the grace and good timing to hack a chunk out of my lip two days ago. Never combine shaving and sneezing. It's, <laughs> it's not the time saver you might think. Well, thankfully, our next guest lived to tell the tale. I don't know how his shaving went this morning, but uh -huh. Derek Edwards has a show coming up in Vancouver. A little bit of stand-up for you. How are you, Derek? Derek, nice I'm, to see you again. I'm great. Thanks for having me on the show. That's not the end of the bit. You know, it like goes on to something actually funny. That was just <laughs> I a, thought that was quite funny. Beginning, just starting off slow before you change gear and get into the funny stuff at the end. Thanks for, you know, focusing yeah. in on the dribble. This, this is what happens all. when you allow yourself to come on any sort of television show. We always condense your entire body of work into a good, you know, 10 or 15 second snippet. Yes, of, of, of dribble. Right. The, of right. Specific, the more dribbly it is, the more likely it's going to be on your show. But show. you Thank survived your shaving this morning, I see. Yeah, yeah. I scraped down this morning. <laughs> Actually, Straight I used down. to have a, I did one of these uh, where the nose joins the rest of you. I oh, cut right. right in the air, ah. which is, fun. yeah, because I forgot, did I have three blades or was it seven blades? You know, I think you've increased the, uh, I didn't Does it allocate. make a difference ha never having shaved my face? Yes, yes, the multiple blades. So you're blades. having trouble relating is what you're saying? <laughs> yes. Now? What well, about the legs? this is always going to be the way. I don't uh, have a nose on my legs. No, 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 but you have a knee. Isn't that a hard area to shave? Not really. Oh, okay. Do you get airy knees? No way. <laughs> Like, isn't, isn't there gaps, like the palm of your hand and the bottom of your foot? Do you get hairy? You know what? Girls right? don't have body hair. It's just best to think of it that way. All the same with the whole flatulence thing. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, just, doesn't, doesn't yeah that's sweating. true. Yeah, that's until you live with a girl for a little while and you realize that You're all wife. Things, Stop it. No, she doesn't. She's the aberration among all <laughs> women. It's a miracle. So how is your road I was been? calling your wife an aberration. To, uh, I'm just, <laughs> you open the door. Derek is now, he's, <laughs> I'm in he some became trouble. a mean comic. What I'm in no, trouble. And I, of course, didn't, uh, I haven't met her, so I don't know. That's what you Good say one. now. <laughs> That's what I say. <laughs> <laughs> so has your, how has your tour been? You're, this is wrapping it up here uh, in Vancouver. Yeah. Oh, well, I mean, uh, the actual BC tour hasn't really commenced. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I'm uh, two, two days from now, I start in the island. For some reason, he scheduled me to come back here on the third day so I can take another ferry boat back over there to oh, do whatever. Oh, the ferries whatever's. are awesome. They are pretty cool, yeah. I mean, I'm not whining about it. I just mean it but doesn't seem is, rooted, apparently, correct. <laughs> this is someone uh, who doesn't actually have to do the traveling, right? That, that has That's created right. this route for That's you? right. That's the guy. Yeah. Doesn't have to do the traveling, doesn't have to do the shows, it yeah. doesn't watch what they put on prior to you sitting down on the couch. So let's, <laughs> let's put Derek in Victoria, Vancouver, Nanaimo, uh, maybe back in the interior and then back over on the island. Exactly. Uh, yeah. I asked you earlier how long you've been out on, on this tour and you said sort of sporadically for a year and a half. A year and a half, yeah. Try to polish this tour into a fine sheen. <laughs> Is that because the guy who planned your route a year and a half? How's the polishing, Derek? <laughs> hey, you know, it's kind of getting there. It's hard to polish a tour, honest truth. But uh, <laughs> it's been coming along. <laughs> and uh, so I started the East Coast, kind of working my way west, just in jibs and drabs. They split Ontario into two different halves. Did you I go back know. to Timmins? I did go back to Timmins, not for the show, but just to see uh, <laughs> mom and my sister oh, and okay. some old hockey buddies. Uh, how often do you play? You're from Timmins, Ontario. How often do you actually go back and, and do appearances there? And, and is that weird to go back to your hometown and, and play a show, or is it more comfortable? It was righteously weird last time. <laughs> Why? I got a blind booking. I didn't know what it was coming into town. It was a liberal fundraiser. Oh, yeah. I, I, could, I didn't even know. I got there, there's pictures of Michael Ignati of, you know? <laughs> okay, what is this, some cult or something? And then everybody's got red white buds oh no it's the republicans but no it was liberal <laughs> so i was like the third guest coming in and uh yeah it, that was do you just have to rearrange weird. your set when uh, you find out you're at a political event or you do you really have to uh but it, it's uh turns no shaving out, jokes no well I, I, don't, <laughs> I haven't seen you do a lot of political stuff like i, I don't i don't do a lot of political so stuff. So perfect for a political fundraiser. Oh, man. And I'm doing the thing about voting in Canada is a lot like rolling up the rim. <laughs> what, what, what did I get? <laughs> <laughs> Stupid game. Right? And they're just going, is this, is this what we, do we pay for to get this guy to hack him? So anyway and all, I mean, it's hard to really look at these guys. It's a mudslinging contest. It's been so stunned all the way through. Yeah, yeah. And just low brow. So just, yeah. do, you, do you vote wherever you are on election day or, or do you... Yeah, do they, they give me an exception because I'm a comic. I'm allowed to vote anywhere I want to. 
<laughs> so you have your own show, eh? Right. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, He's the I smart one, early. and so that's the scary part. He's the smart one. Yeah. But his knees are hairless. <laughs> no, mine are. <laughs> ah, sorry, I was out of line again. So there's another comedian doing a little bit of stand-up in Vancouver this evening. His name's Charlie Sheen. Yeah. Charlie have you been following Sheen. this whole debacle? Uh, I only heard the reviews from somebody who went to see Charlie and a fellow named Russell Peters, who's gained some popularity here in Canada. <laughs> yeah, right, yeah. And they said, well, Russell was funny. The rest was, you know, disappointing. <laughs> but I don't know how you can whine that much. Yeah. I don't know what your complaints are. He really doesn't have a, a ton to complain about. He, last I checked, he makes a fair amount of money and, and was raised in a household where someone made a fair amount of money. So. Yeah, yeah. It really wasn't that tough probably coming up the pike, you know. Yeah. I remember him. He was in this movie, Platoon or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. Yeah. He was terrific in that. He should have just taken so, his leave from Is this bit. also a cautionary tale about uh, choosing your opening act wisely as well? I mean, to have Russell Peters go in there, a guy who is genuinely funny, and then follow <laughs> it with Charlie Sheen, a guy who is occasionally <laughs> generally lucid. And uh, have you ever seen the show? No, no. It's but, like humorless. Right. Two and a half. Two and a half, man. It seems to go on two and a half hours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How did he make that much cash from that kind of output? I have no clue. Well... Nevertheless, it, it, uh, if you get if you like insane ramblings and you're, the election's over, you know you can where watch are you Urban going Rush. now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah I'm or sorry. You can watch, watch Urban, Urban Rush. Rush. <laughs> insane ramblings, and uh, we condense careers down to 10 or 15 seconds of uh, your of the worst possible example of that career. Awesome. There we are. Well, right great there. to see you, Derek. You can see Derek Edwards. He will be at the Centennial so Theater awesome. on May the 6th, where he will complete that joke and many more. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> to see the end of the shaving story. We just wanted to leave you with May a cliffhanger. Yeah.